where I come from, the rural Midwest. But it's the land I love more than all the rest. It's the place I know and understand. Like a false front building, like the back of my hand, and the men I knew when I was coming up. Well, they were sober as coffee in a styrofoam cup. There were Earls and Rays, Harlins and Roy. They were full-grown men. They were barbed wire boys. They raised grain and cattle on the treeless fields. Sat at the head of the table and prayed before. Prayed an hour, Father, and that was enough. You pray more than that. You couldn't stay tough to face the busted thumbnails on their weathered hands. They worked the gold plate off of their wedding bands, and they never complained. They never made noise, and they never left home. These barbed wire boys, for their wildest dreams were all fenced in by the weight of family, by the feeling of sin. Prick your skin at the slightest touch. If you reach too far, if you feel too much, so their deepest hopes never were expressed. Just beaten like birds' wings in the cages of their chests. All the restless longings, all the secret joys that never were set free in the barbed wire boys. Now one by one they are departing this earth. And it's clear to me now exactly what they're worth. Well, they were just like Atlas, holding up the sky. You never heard him speak. You never saw him cry. But where do the tears go that you never shed? Where do the words go that you never said? Well, there's a blink of the eye. There's a catch in the voice that is the unsung song of the bar.